since I erased most of my videos accidentally of doing this, uh, this is a 93 F-150 short wheelbase four wheel drive, the 5.8 liter. And it's uh, the computer location in these is right down here. So that's your computer. You'll take that center bolt out, unplug this, take these other two bolts out. You got to unbolt this fender well, plastic fender well right here. You got a bolt here, one there, one there, one underneath. And you got this one back here. Then you take and you pry this out and down. And I stuck a piece of pipe in here to lift it to get my computer out of the way. Before you do that, take your battery cables off. Anyway, this thing had been having troubles. They'd replaced a fuel pump, which I told them it didn't need, and a uh, throttle position sensor. It was still having intermittent problems. So it was a bad computer. They pulled a code up on it. Uh, anyway, so I pulled it out and I found a capacitor that had uh, had corrosion on it. One of the legs broke off and also a corroded heat sink. I cleaned it up, put a new capacitor in, re-soldered it, uh, and put some dielectric grease on it. The stuff I used to do this was a desoldering little tool, help blow or suck the solder off the circuit board. Dielectric silicone grease, so it's non-conductive, keeps it from corroding again. And then uh, this little turbo torch or benzomatic uh, Little propane torch worked pretty good. Watch you a video on about how to solder circuit boards on YouTube before you try to do any of this stuff. And uh, don't forget to get your can of, uh, I guess it's butane, uh, can of lighter fluid to refill this thing with. Anyway, I uh, hope this and my other videos will help somebody out. Just uh, look for corrosion on the circuit board before you go and buy a new computer. After I did the repairs, the thing ran fine so far. We'll see if it keeps doing it.